In this training session, we're going to look at how to process the recurring charges that we've created. So I'm going to click on the Process button. Now if we look at our information here, we've got our invoice date. In other words, this is the date that you want to run this charge. You've got your color legend that will describe all your information. If there's errors with it, if it needs specific item, price, if there's a crucial error, or if it is a problem with stock. You also have the list here that describes all the red options are crucial errors. Then you have non-crucial errors. We then have a recurring charge which will show all the applicable charges that's available to process right now. You've got your detailed problem information and then we've got our options at the bottom where we can remove a recurring charge. We don't want that charge there. We've got our option flash. In other words, that will allow you to have quick access to report that you can create that has got to do with these recurring charges. Your set prices will allow you to set the prices. We can refresh the information. In other words, that you might be busy with the screen and in the meantime some information has changed. Then you've got report options and then you can run your charge. Now in the next training session I'm going to discuss the detailed problem information. And that concludes talking about processing a recurring charge.